Hi everyone! I have a new Thumb My Shinky haul for you guys today because my phone doesn't want to fit everything. So I did try to put everything together in one video, but was not gonna happen. <laughs> Just not gonna happen. Um, mostly because I keep talking a lot. So sorry about that. You'll be getting two videos instead of one with my first quarter haul. So for part one, as you can see from the spread here, I have Toho Shinki items to show you. One item you probably have seen previously before, but I am going to clarify some things that I said in that video besides it's unlisted. So if you're new to this channel, you probably haven't seen it anyways. Um, let's start counterclockwise. So we'll end with OT5. Let's start with Jajong. So Jajong. I love you, Jajong. I hate your company, though. So, <laughs> she just keeps releasing DD DVDs, and I, as an unemployed person, do feel like I need to give you guys a bit of um, a review here. I did already actually unbox this, so if you guys want to see that, it's on my channel somewhere. If I remember, I'll put it in the description box below. Um, quick review, though. I like that they changed it up a bit. If you guys have seen the previous unboxings that I've made for like the trade parties, um, there was another one. There's like three that just the same style, same size. It's just not not pretty, <laughs> very not pretty. Especially the last Japanese um, DVD that he released, the blue one, J Party. Really, it's not Japanese, is it? Anyway, I like that they changed the design, but. Um, I don't like the horizontal photo book, especially when it's not giving me full shots of the artist. So, if you're a fan, most definitely, you're going to want to buy it anyway, so that's not for you. If you're just a casual fan and want to know if you should get this, like if you only want one DVD of his, my recommendation is still, for the music, the concert wise, it's going to be... JYJ's, um, JYJ's, Jejong's, um, WWW DVD, the Japanese one. So this is, I think, the Korea. The Japanese one is, like, his third release ever, like, for a DVD. It's the black one. That one is still my number one recommendation. If you just want something pretty in terms of photo book, I would recommend the one that's in the bubble mailer. That one is, I like those pictures the most. Um, so, yeah, quick review. Uh, I'll give it a B minus just because it's Jajong. Uh, it's pretty, so it's a B minus. Um, next, I bought this pamphlet. I mean, I didn't buy it after, but I got this pamphlet just so I could try out um, the store market, whatever you want to call it, um, Zen market. So, a lot of my friends on YouTube are actually like purchasing from Sun Market right now, and um, it appealed to me. But we'll get more into that in a review video that I'm gonna film. That's why I purchased that, and then just so I could, <laughs> I would say just so I could compare. I bought this from from Japan, but really, um, Sana Storia. She made an unboxing for with the concept photo book or the concept pamphlet for their tour with, and I went to from Japan so I could buy it, but but I decided on this one instead. Um, I don't remember what changed my mind. Oh, the price! It's still a bit too pricey for me, but actually it has gone down since it first was released. I still went with this one instead. It's a beautiful photo book, and I'm, I mean pamphlet, photo book, whatever you want to call it. I still am going to collect all of them, so there's no rush, I guess. It's a beautiful, beautiful pamphlet. Um, I'll be talking more about these in my review video. I will be doing an unboxing of the JYJ pamphlet because I cannot find it on YouTube. It might just be me, though. Um, close to you, Changmin. So if you guys know, I have pretty much their main discography, like the only other big release that I had been missing was Flower, 
this is like that's a repackage though so it was, it's not that big a priority as Chinese was however it was really pricey to begin with um I just I gave up <laughs> like earlier this year I saw it on eBay listed it was still expensive but I was like you know what it's the only city that I'm really missing let me just buy it and I bought it so I have it finally quick review on this is that the reason why it took me so long to purchase it compared to Yunho's is because I'm not a fan of the music on here. Um, when it first came out, I tried to listen to it. I just I couldn't get into it. And when I received it and put it into my iPod, I was like, okay, I have to listen to it again. Maybe I just wasn't in the mood. But it's just not, it's not that. It's just I guess I'm not into whatever it just sounds so weird to me like it's not weird I don't remember it felt like I, I just I just can't like it I don't like it okay um, I might give it another like listen to it like I'll try and concentrate see if I can like get into it but I've tried like three times I just I can't get into it um so let's go towards this side here. Chunsu. If you collect um, OSTs and if you collect them in Shinki, then you know how annoying they can be. Um, if you don't get the OST as soon as they release, especially, you're not gonna get it like in a year from the release. Like they just they're so <laughs> they run out of print so fast. So if you get it. Um, if you plan to get it, get it as soon as it's there. Don't wait for a sale, it might not be there. However, if you want to wait and get it cheaper, I understand. Um, but I, I know how rare they can become. So, this is their latest OST. I got this in a purchase from Yes Asia to complete a package. I forgot. Oh, I bought it. Wow, it's been, has it been that long? Have I shown you guys this CD? Because I purchased this, I'm pretty sure, with Jejong's um, photo book CD thing. No, I purchased the other one with that. What did I purchase with this? I don't remember what I purchased with that. Anyway, Junsu released an OST. I collect OST, so here it is. I actually really do like the song. Um... Sometimes there are a couple of songs that sound kind of bland. Um, this one, I do remember that I liked it. Um, Junsu keeps releasing OSTs and I'm glad he's in the army because now all the things that I need to worry about him are DVDs. And because DVDs are like the last thing on my list, I don't have to worry about him. Moving on. <laughs> let's, let's save time for last because I tend to talk a, lo a lot about this one. So let's go to Superstar. So the Superstar CD DVD, I did purchase that recently from Amazon. Um, actually, I purchased it from a seller that wasn't shipping my orders. So almost a month had passed and he hadn't or they hadn't shipped my order. Um, I emailed them, what's going on? Ship it. What are you doing? They finally shipped it and it got here without a Nobi strip. It was unpleasant. It was an unpleasant experience, just to say the least. Um, I also purchased Ocean CD DVD from Amazon. That one, however, it did arrive. Did it arrive fast? No, it, it still arrived in a month, but it had everything on it. Like it had a photo card and it had the OB strip. So, like, I don't really care about photo cards, but I do care about the OB strip. So I was really happy that it had the OB strip. Then, this one, so about OB strips, I did purchase this one last year, um, but it did not have the OB strip. Why isn't it focusing? Anyway, I bought this last year, it did not have the OB strip, so I just, I'm like, oh my god, I, I can't not have the OB strip, like, I was just not in a good mood, I guess, so I decided to purchase the jewel case, the normal jewel case with the OB strip without the need of the photo book because I already had a photo book. So I purchased a second copy just for the damn OB strip, which I'm eventually going to do once I 
have all the singles that I really want, so eventually, not yet though. Um, so another purchase that I made a big kind of purchase was the Stay Photo Book. So the Stay Photo Book is <laughs> something that I wish I had an unboxing to watch just so I could know what I was doing before I did it. So do expect an unboxing of that Stay Photo Book because it is the same shoot as the Green Stay Photo Book and I just want people to be informed <laughs> when they buy it. Um, it's the same photo shoot for those that didn't know. I don't know why I thought it wasn't a, like a different, completely different photo shoot. I don't know. It's on me though, so I didn't like look it up, obviously, or else I probably would have found out. <laughs> Expect an unboxing of that one for sure. So now to OT5. I have three minutes and that's it before my phone cuts me off. Um, the Rising Sun Showcase. So the showcase is a limited edition, like, VCD, um, that they released back in the day. And it's probably, it's just a showcase. I was actually looking at, at it, like, a month or so ago. Um, I have it sealed, and I didn't know it was sealed. I, I'm pretty sure I bought it used. It came sealed anyway, and I'm just gonna keep it sealed, because it... There's nothing really to unbox in it, it's just a small little, like, ad, I'm pretty sure. So, I'm just gonna keep it sealed for now. Yeah. And then, something I wanted to clarify for the Rising Sun brown cover. It is a Hong Kong version, that is the first version there was for that cover. However, there's two other Asian versions, I don't remember what the countries are exactly right now. But there is a, like differences between the Hong Kong and the other Asian versions. So always try and get the ones with the extra music video. I didn't realize that there was a difference. So when I purchased it, I just, oh, brown cover, let me buy it. When it arrived and I looked up the Rising Sun City, I realized that there is a difference. So be careful just in case you don't want to buy like two copies. Just look at what you're buying. The last two things here, um, uh, let's talk about the video clip, should be fast. The video clip collection for Toho Shinki. So it includes all their music videos, except for the um, subunit stuff, by which I mean um, Yu Chun and Jejong and Junsu. So every other music video is on this video clip collection. And it's just a perfect thing to have if you just want the music videos in one place. Um, it was cheap as hell, which is really why I bought it, so yay. And then the last thing is the All About Dong Bang Shinki Season 3. So my copy is still sealed. Again, just like the video clip collection, I got it for a really cheap, cheap price. And that's really the main reason why I purchased it. Um... It has a photo book inside that you can, like, open it for, but for the meantime, I'm just going to keep it sealed, at least until I get, um, my Season 2 and Season 1 DVDs. I haven't purchased them yet, but I do want to get them sooner rather than later, so let's hope to getting them before the year ends. So, this is my Dumbang Shingi haul, guys, and I will be making other videos for this, or, like, for a lot of these things, eventually. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna write more in the description if I think of something else that I wanted to say, just because I am running out of time here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my part two. Bye!